It is a cause that is close to his heart. Michel Barnier's mother was the president of a mental health union. And he, as prime minister, said the issue would be the great national cause of 2025. But some in the public health sector fear that such promises will not translate to the necessary financial support for an issue that is widespread in France. From burnout to depression to psychiatric breaks, 13 million French people, or one in five, have psychological troubles, according to the health ministry. A recent Ipsos poll published on Global Mental Health Day found that 34 percent of the French questioned said they're stressed out on a daily basis. A third also feel that mental health is a major problem. The issue is far from just a French one. Globally, mental health, the poll showed, has surpassed cancer as the major health concern. In France, the public health sector is struggling to keep up. A parliamentary document two years ago said that the number of people using psychiatric help had jumped from 1 million in 1997 to 2.3 million in 2020. And the need for help is only increasing. Last month, there was a significant jump in emergency room cases of young people with suicidal thoughts or acts. Santé Publique France said that there was a 70 percent spike compared to August. And overall, the number of suicidal youth is much higher than in previous years. All this while an average of 7 percent of psychiatric beds in hospitals were shuttered in 2023. The sector faces a major personnel problem. 40 percent of public hospitals are missing more than a quarter of psychiatric staff. Medical students are turning away from the sector, which despite multiple campaigns remains largely taboo.